Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's GK. Welcome to Living the Hobby High Life. That's exactly what I hope you're doing today. I'm going to go over some uh, sales that we've got getting ready to put into team bags, write thank you notes, and send on their way to new homes. The first off is this 1993 Tops Gold Major League Managers, Lou Pinella and Joe Torre. Same collector also picked up this 1986 Topps Collector Series of Willie McGee. So kind of a surprising purchase right there, but man, we'll take it. Next on the list is a 2019 Legacy J.J. Watt with the red borders. As you can see, 76 out of 299. One of the things I'm learning about different teams, for instance, like the Texans, um, the Texans don't get a lot of views. So I've got like four listings, uh, team listings for Texans, and they all average around 200, 300 views. Whereas a team like, for instance, the Steelers are well over a thousand and, and the listings are maybe a couple months old. So that's just an interesting thing. Even though a popular player like JJ Watt, um, it's kind of a slow seller just because of the amount of traffic. Um, also a couple more surprises going out to a fan of the steel curtain, Jack Lambert, one of the stalwarts of that defense throughout the seventies and early eighties, as you can see a 1990 hall of fame selection, this is a 1990 pro set and they doubled up on this one right here. I, I can't really tell who that poor cowboy is, but man, it looks like he's in a, a bad way. And then we've got a 2020 score captains, Ben Roethlisberger, or no, I'm wrong, 2018. 2018 score Ben Roethlisberger going out to a separate Steelers collector. And one of the, the cool things about this, of course, these are just regular 35-point top loaders. Um, believe it or not, we were able to fit these two cards in a 35-point. It was pretty, pretty cool. You know, some of the uh, thinner paper stock cards from the junk wax era you know they're, they're like that and then you know thank thank goodness for lions fans all right and we'll go through this little stack real quick we've got a 1993 playoff barry sanders ground attack parallel insert you know um back in the day when playoff came out with this tech chrome finish and you can see it on the back it'll say you know exclusive tech chrome technology or whatever these were some amazing cards you know and even still to this day i think they stand the test of time up against inserts and he also picked up a 2019 prism draft picks barry sanders all americans and believe it or not there's a third card in here nope nope changed it up but that is a 75 point top loader you know the the card stock on this was pretty thick same as that i think like 35 point cardstock i've got a 2018 red white and blue prism marvin jones as you can see that movement there lions are another team just like the texans that seem to to sit on the shelf quite a while other than barry sanders barry sanders seems to move um and then a 2020 season tickets 2020 contenders season ticket barry sanders and that oklahoma state cowboy uniform Got a 2019 Prism, 2019 Select Prism, Field Level, Matthew Stafford. Beautiful card right there. Beautiful card, beautiful pose. And then follow that up with, I believe, a 2017 Origins, Matthew Stafford as well. Then he picked up a 2014 Calvin Johnson Megatron tops all pro in the in a snow game versus the eagles great photography there man you know i love that and then a 2013 tops triple thread golden tate 43 out of 232 i really like this triple thread series and believe it or not man you can find hobby boxes relatively inexpensive and then that same lions fan happened to stop by and pull this drew breeze from 2018 Nice looking prismatic card, beautiful card for, you know, it's kind of surprising, you know, so you see a, uh, quite a few Lions cards 
And then the same buyer also picked up this 2017 uh, Derrick Henry prism. So all in all, not not too bad. You know, if it wasn't for Lions fans, man, we, we'd, we'd be in rough shape going into today. But we're going to get these team bagged, put in bubble mailers and envelopes, and then we'll send them on their way. So thanks for stopping by, man. We appreciate it. Always appreciate your feedback. Uh, it's always great to talk to and co connect with everybody out there. So until next time, man, keep on living that hobby high life.